Governor Babajide Sonwolu, the Commissioner for Environment and Water Resources, Tukumbo Wahab, and other state officials visit Lagos Island to inspect the drainage channels in the area. Ojogiwa Jankara, a popular area where business activities take place on a daily basis, is taken over by flood. People have no other choice than to move through the water. Other streets in the area are also faced with the same issue of flood due to blocked drainage. Governor Sonwolu says Jankara and two other markets will be demolished for proper regeneration of Lagos Island. It is an official notice again that we will take and clean up the entire market. We will start fully with the Bombata, Bombata market and the Jankara market. It's going to be ground zero, you know, and there's a full design of what we're going to be putting there. With the Pelerura market, because it's currently about a large number of the citizens, we're going to give them adequate notice, you know, and we're going to be working with our concessionaires and with the local government. All of the stakeholders will um, be brought, 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 brought on board and we will, we will all agree as to when that demolition and that um, um, evacuation will start. It was also an opportunity to stop over at Ilubiri pumping station where a drainage project is ongoing. He says two of the channels will be ready in the next two months. Each of those pumps will be automatically activated. Each one, once the, 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 the water channel gets up to four meters from what I'm told, pump one will kick off. Once it gets to 5.5, pump two will kick off. And if there's a need for pump three, it will also. But we've never seen. So we we'll build capacity and we we'll also build redundancy you know, as a final solution for the drainage evacuation from Lagos Island. That is for this location. So we will continue to do the work, and I'm sure that by December or January we will come back here. This project here will be completed. Achieving a clean and safe environment is everyone's responsibility. The Lagos State government says owners of property found blocking the drainage will be made to face the full wrath of the law.